homeless man decides to share his resume instead of asking for pennies, lands up hundreds of job offers. They say that consistence is key and that's especially true when it comes to finding a job. These days it can be especially hard the way the job market has been. When one man realized that he wasn't getting a job opportunity by sending his resume the old-fashioned way, he decided to take matters into his own hands. You won't believe how one homeless man's luck turned around when he decided to put himself out there in the most direct way possible. David Casares grew up in Laredo, Texas. He earned a bachelor's in management information systems from Texas A&M University. Once out of college, he landed a great job. Once he graduated college, Cesares landed a job as a web developer at General Motors in Austin. However, he decided to cash out his 401k and go after a bigger dream. So what did Cesares want to do? You see, Cesares had big dreams of starting up his own company. He figured with his skill set and the money he got from his 401k, he could make his dream come true. So he drove to Silicon Valley and decided to get his tech startup off the ground. However, things didn't pan out the way Cesaris had envisioned it. His company didn't get off the ground and he quickly ran out of cash. This left Cesaris homeless and in a serious rut. I'd been living in my car for more than a year, he explained. No one was hiring. I had an interview with Apple in January, but the job was filled internally. So Cesaris was running out of options and decided to try to do some freelancing work in the meantime. So Cesaris began to take on freelance work for different clients. However, it wasn't enough for him to sustain a good quality of life. Soon enough, he couldn't afford his car payments and his car was repossessed. He was officially homeless at that point. Cesaris was sleeping on a bench in a park and he knew that he had to do something drastic to get himself out of his situation. He started to go through all the different possibilities in his head. Sending out his resume to companies wasn't working, so what could he do? The young man knew that he couldn't sleep on a park bench for the rest of his life. He graduated college and had a great skill set. So he came up with the most brilliant idea to get his resume out there for employers to see. So on a Friday morning, Cesares woke up from his park bench and put on his nicest shirt and tie. He then put together a cardboard sign that read, Homeless, Hungry for Success, Take a Resume. Then, while holding up the sign, he stood near the highway with the most packed cars. People were immediately intrigued by Cesares, and one person even took a photo of him standing out there. That person decided to post about the incident on his Twitter. The tweet instantly went viral. The tweet that went viral read, Today I saw this young homeless man asking for people to take a resume rather than asking for money. If anyone in the Silicon Valley would help him out, that would be amazing. Please retweet so we can help David out. Everyone began to share the tweet so that Cesares could get an employment opportunity. Soon enough, Cesares was flooded with job opportunities from hundreds of different companies. Altogether, he received about 200 job opportunities. He was overwhelmed by the response he received. Google reached out to me, Cesares exclaimed. So many other companies. Pandora, a bunch of startups. The 26-year-old couldn't believe that his idea to walk around with a cardboard sign actually worked. A production manager from Bitcoin.com was wondering if I could work remotely or if I want to relocate to Tokyo, he said as he scrolled through all his offers. One CEO even offered non-profit funding to assist with housing for Cesares. However, for now, Cesares will return to his bench at the park. Cesares is currently sifting through all the responses that he's acquired. In the meantime, however, Cesares is going back to the bench. But tonight I'll be back on my bench in Rengsdorf Park. Still, Cesaris is in shock at how everything played out. He made sure to dress up as nice as possible so that future employees would get a good first impression of him. He also had a stack of resumes sitting in front of him in a FedEx envelope. It was basically a make or break moment, he said. I wanted to keep my head up high, keep looking forward and see what opportunity would come next. I was thinking, you know, this was like my last stop. If this didn't work, I'd go back home and give up on my dream. I knew it would be posted on social media. I didn't know it would blow up like this, he told KNTV. 
I'm trying not to take any money. I really do just want a job opportunity. That's all I'm asking. Now that's exactly what the young man's been given. Now all that Cesares has to do is narrow down his choices to the job that fit his skills the best. While it might take him a while to do that, it's definitely better than having no opportunity at all. The young man is certainly thankful for everyone that's reached out to him. Cesares' actions really prove that thinking outside the box and never giving up can pay off in the end. Now Cesares has a plethora of job opportunities waiting for him. We can bet that he'll be employed pretty soon.